Hi, I'm Sarah Weiler, and I'm an independent distributor for Premier Designs Jewelry. And today I'm just going to go through another piece of jewelry. Um, it's actually one of my top sellers for Premier. It's this necklace. It's called Manhattan. I'm just going to show you a few different ways to wear this necklace. So if you end up buying it someday, take it home. I don't want you to forget. So you can just pull me up on YouTube and look through the different ways of wearing this necklace. You have um, some hematite here, and you also have some silver. Um, Manhattan has like um, a little bit of both. It kind of fades in and out, if you will. Um, it is made up of different strands, but it is connected in the back with a lobster claw. And um, so it also has a delicate look, but we can also make um, a chunkier look. So I'm gonna show you different ways to do that. First of all, we have the normal way of wearing this necklace just like this, very simple, but it's very elegant at the same time. Now we're gonna take this, and I'm gonna open up the lobster claw, and I'm gonna double the necklace around. So we go one, two, connect it again. And then we can um, have two layers, like this. Then, I like to also, you know, this is nice for a simple look, but if you're wanting to um, add a little bit more, then we can take an enhancer. This one is called our Romance Enhancer. We have many different types of enhancers in the catalog, but this is one that I like with this necklace. And we can put it here, and we can fix the layers to how we want it, and we can look like that. So this is just another idea. You don't have to pick this one. It's just something that I like with this necklace. So we have our Manhattan doubled and we have our Romance Enhancer with that. Then we can take this off. And can do a few other things with this necklace. So I'm gonna connect the lobster claw once again. And then we're gonna take it, and it's already closed, and we're gonna split the layers. It doesn't have to be perfectly in half, but it's gonna look like this. We're gonna put it behind our neck, and then we literally take the strands and tie a knot. So it looks like this. Now you can decide where you want this, if you want it high, if you want it low. You can wear it like this, plain, or you can take another enhancer. This one actually has a pin back, so you can wear a pin on a shirt. This is called ruffles, but we can also pin it to our necklace. So we take our pin, and we put it in like this, and we have this look right here. You can do this with any pin that you have at home or something that you get from the Premier catalog, but this is just another idea. We can take the pin off, and we're going to change the necklace once again. This time, we're gonna go back to the start, we're gonna undo the clasp. When we undo it, we just let it hang. We're gonna kinda try to get any knots out that are there. We split them in half, put it over your head. So now, we have a clasp on either side. We're gonna swap hands. And then we're going to reach behind our head and clasp this. And now you can pull on the layers here. And you have three layers now. This is a very pretty look just like this. Or once again, what do you think I'm going to do? We can take our enhancer, our romance enhancer. Connect it here. Oh, I forgot to say that this romance enhancer is magnetic. So it's easy for off and on, but it's also uh, good because it's sturdy. So this is another look. We can have our three layers, breaks up some dimension uh, with whatever outfit we're wearing, and then we can add an enhancer. So this is another look. Now, one more thing. We can take this off and go back to how we were before, the normal. And when we put this back on, there's another option. We can do layering. Layering adds a little bit extra as well. So we have the Manhattan Normal. By the way, side note, I am wearing the Manhattan earrings. So if you want to look matchy earrings to the necklace, just a side note. Then we can also take our Silver Moon necklace. Very pretty. Has a little bit of crystals, a little bit of pearls. 
and just layer it over top and you can see how it just frames the Manhattan necklace. Another way uh, to wear the Manhattan necklace that I really like is you take it like this, make sure you keep one finger where the clasp is because you don't want that to show. So we're going to twist it like this. So you see it makes, it looks like a solid chain. Then we're going to take our Clip It. Clip It's are only $10. They have hematite, silver, bronze, and gold. We're going to take my hematite Clip It and put it through each side. Then I put it behind my neck. And you have this look. After you do this, you can decide, okay, if you want to just leave it like this, you can, but once again, I'm going to show you with the Romance Enhancer. So I'm going to take my Romance Enhancer, and I'll magnetically clip it on here, and I have this look. So those are just some of my ideas for the Manhattan Necklace. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon.